almost falling out. <laughs> yeah, so cold from Cleveland, guys. Yeah. No, guys are dismissed. Have a great weekend. Thanks. Yeah. You Way too. to kill some Thank time. Scratch. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome in to another fresh hour of Sports Center. Alongside Linda Cohn, I am David Lloyd. They have the shovels out. They've got the plows out. They're still digging out in Buffalo. Yeah, we got a bigger problem, though. Is it possible that some Bills players will not be able to get to Detroit for the Monday night game against the Jets? It's possible. We've got the latest on that. Plus, David? Here's what's happening. What me? And if you love point guard play, you're going to want to watch this game. This is why we have one of the best. Our Avery Johnson is here to break down this matchup between Kyrie Irving and John Wall. What stands out for you when these two guys clash heads? Well, they both are so uh, awesome in trans addition for their team. You know who else is a fan of Paul Pierce? LeBron James calls <laughs> him one of the most consistent players wow. he faces each game that he does. Uh, 8 o'clock Eastern, Cavs and Wizards. Thanks, Avery. Thanks. Let's bring in ESPN NFL insider Dan Graziano. And Dan, what will the NFL make of Peterson's comments to USA Today? It was important for him to say what he said. Talk about a trap. We saw the Chiefs fall into the black hole last night of the Oakland Raiders. We're joined by ESPN NFL analyst Mark Schlereth. All right, we're going to name him. Eagles, which of those three most likely to fall in the trap game Sunday? I'm going to say the Philadelphia Eagles. Yeah. It's not a trap game for the Indianapolis Colts because, uh, you know, it just isn't. They're playing Jacksonville, that we know. But Indy is still recovering from that loss right. to the Patriots. Plus, they lose a key cog in that offense in Ahmad Bradshaw for the season. So how does Andrew Luck and the rest of this Colts team adjust and get this W? It'll be really interesting because two key cogs. And see, that's really what's going to hurt this Indianapolis Colts team with those two guys out. It helps them that they are playing at home. So that gives them that does a little help. bit of an edge yeah. against Jacksonville. Mark Schlereth, thank you. You got it, Elko.